hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i am going to continue with this uh, steps for vrf design uh, which was uh, our last steps uh, prepare the shop drawing with equipment schedule so we have to prepare the shop drawing for our project here so for this one we have to open uh, let me open the equipment selection here already the piping layout i have done i will just update the tag number and pipe sizing as well so go to this uh, equipment selection this is open this okay and you can see here the length and uh, pipe size is already given here so how to update this you can see the last uh, uh, terminal is the ducted uh, split so the length is 3 meter and uh, here is the 5 by 8 by 3 by 8 so we have to update okay and uh, here okay so just copy this text and uh, here is your pipe size okay five by eight three by eight go to the property and here the text size text size is one feet one feet okay here double click 5 by 8 3 by 8 5 by 8 is the gas pipe okay so here you can change the color you can make it red and here is the liquid so you can take another color okay let us take this okay so this is your pipe size and uh, just uh, for the tag you can check here the ducted split in the schedule here equipment selection ducted split here you can copy this text you can update your duct table ducted split and the capacity is 6.67 kilowatt 6.67 kilowatt 6.67 kilowatt okay and pipe length from this here to here <coughs> just measure in AutoCAD DI you can enter DI which is called distance command and type M for multiple so here is your pipe length okay so two feet so just copy this text and you can place it here double click open bracket two feet like this the pipe length is two feet and uh, here is your uh, details and then next is your uh, cassette unit so let me copy this as well so this text you have to copy from here place it here you can say CSA, CSA cassette type, cassette split, 
and uh, from this selection you can check 10.53 uh, kilowatt 10.53 kilowatt 10.53 kilowatt and then pipe size uh, you can also check here 5 by 8 3 by 8 and the length you can measure this is uh, the length is given in the selection we just enter the equal uh, for selecting the unit uh, and uh, actual uh, length you can measure here in this drawing and you can place it okay so just copy this uh, pipe size from here you can place here okay and one more here 5 by 8 3 by 8 and di okay, multiple like this okay 12 feet so just update here 12 feet pipe size pipe length and uh, pipe size is 5 by 8 and 3 by 8 okay and here is cassette unit 10.51 kilowatt next is your uh, uh, this cassette which is 5 by 8 3 by 8 and 8.46 kilowatt so similarly we have to copy here 8.46 just double click to edit 8.46 kilowatt and pipe size is same 5 by 8 3 by 8 so let me copy this okay and place it here just i will change the length so i will enter the di from here and type m for multiple here we go okay you can see here 30 feet so double click to edit here which is pipe length 30 feet okay next uh, your uh, after this uh, your uh, this cassette 5 by 8 3 by 8 again 7.52 kilowatt 5 8 3 8 okay just copy here okay just place it here okay copy the text as well You can say here cassette 1, 2, 3 like this, cassette 0, 1, cassette 0, 3, which is uh, 8.46 kilowatt, 8.46 kilowatt, and here is your uh, cassette 1, 2, 3. Let's check it here. Cassette 1, 2, 3, 7.52 kilowatt. Okay. Here is your 7.52. 7.52. Here cassette 2, 8.46. Okay. Just check this schedule and update the drawing. Cassette 2. And the last is 8.46 uh, and uh, 5 by 8, 3 by 8 again. So 5 by 8, 3 by 8 and cassette 3 and cassette 4. So just uh, copy this. Okay. And here place, you can place it here. Okay. Double click to edit cassette 4. Which is... Uh, 8.46 kilowatt 8.46 and 5 by 8 3 by 8 and pipe length is just check this di m for multiple here you go 25 feet double click to edit 25 feet and then here is 30 feet here you can also check di m for multiple and here you go 12 feet double click to edit 12 feet okay so this is how and here what will the pipe size from uh, the last wrap net to the outdoor unit you can check it here 
from last ref net to outdoor unit 1 and 1 by 8 and 5 by 8 1 and 1 by 8 and 5 by 8 so let me copy this you can place it here 1 and 1 by 8 5 by 8 ok and uh, pipe length you can check di from here to here 23 feet 23 feet ok and then from this ref net to this ref net you can also update from this ref net to this ref net 1 and 1 by 8 5 by 8 ok so 1 and 1 by 8 5 by 8 you can copy this you can place it down here and you can place it here okay just copy this also 1 and 1 by 8 5 by 8 and uh, the pipe length is you can check 9 feet 9 feet from this ref net to this ref net what will be the pipe size 7 by 8 and half ok 7 by 8 half here also 7 by 8 half 7 by 8 half so from this one 7 by 8 half so let me copy this place it here 7 by 8 and half 7 by 8 and half ok and uh, here the length just measure from here to here which is 11 feet okay <coughs> the last one 7 by 8 half and then di you can measure from here to here which is 7 feet okay so this is uh, over so this uh, uh, this much of uh, information you have to update and here you can the last uh, uh, update is uh, the outdoor unit you can also update which is uh, here the outdoor unit uh, the outdoor unit uh, model number and uh, kilowatt so kilowatt uh, you can check I think this is 16 kilowatt here the total kilowatt is 16 kilowatt you can also update this one ODU ODU okay and 16 kilowatt 16 kilowatt model number you can also update so this is how we are uh, doing the pipe sizing uh, for this uh, VRF system so in the next tutorials I will do the uh, shop drawing for this uh, fresh air uh, ducting so please be with me and keep watching my video so thank you for watching my video thank you bye bye